Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome. Today we have another Gymshark haul. I know we just had one, how do we have another one so soon? Gymshark just had to go and release the butterfly collection. It is so beautiful, I'm so excited. The only thing is I'm wondering how close it is to the Mercury, but I don't care. I had to at least order it and check it out. Oh my gosh, so, this time we once again have two packages. They are enormous. Yup, two big bad boys. <laughs> I'm not sure which is which, but I cannot wait to dig in. So let's get to it. Starting with the blue color, it is a very like purpley blue. It's like a periwinkle. And then it has some purple running through it for the butterfly print. It is so pretty. It is definitely different from the um, Mercury. I thought maybe it was going to be similar, but it really is so different. I find it's kind of like a springy purpley color, but it's it's gorgeous. Um, and I love when they have just the little shark logo. And then when you have the sports bra, it's going to match. So from top to bottom, you have the shark at the top on the left when you're wearing it and then the left for the pants. The waistband is nice and thick. I really feel like these kind of waistbands give really good compression around the tummy, but then they don't dig in. Of course, there's no seam in the front because they are seamless, but they do have the little scrunch bum in the back. So interested to see how that feels when it's on. Now the shorts, also have the scrunch but these are a cycling length so if you're used to like the other camo shorts these are going to be longer um, but they do have the scrunch on the back and they do have that same shark right on the side there with the logo so similar it's just kind of like a shorter length so when you hold them up you know they kind of match up perfectly except the length and then I like with the sports bra, it is a higher neck. I mean, I love the V-neck of the other ones, but just for a change, it's kind of nice to switch it up. So you do have the V-neck, the removable cup pads, and then the back is so pretty. Um, it kind of has a similar back to the other sports bras, like from the um, animal. And then I really like this bottom I feel like that's gonna be like supportive. And then of course the green, this beautiful blue green. This is like my color. I remember when the Animal Marl came out, I was like all about it. Um, so that's like a little bit more blue than this. But this is like the perfect blue green. So gorgeous. I'm sad they didn't have the shorts cause I feel like if I had to choose, I might, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see when they're on. Um, and then these are teal. I mean, it definitely goes with like the darker. So there is the dark and the light green running through. So this would match the darker portions in there. And then it also would match with the sports bra. Although on camera, it's not exact but they're just different fabrics so sometimes different fabrics will kind of take the dye differently um, so we also have of course the black and I went for these after because the black I feel like doesn't sell as quick but I thought like that might just be a nice basic to have I actually don't have black in the um, other like the camo collection I don't have any black so I thought that might be nice and the camo is just so comfortable. And then they did have the jacket in black. It also came in like the silvery taupe color. So I thought that could be really cool. I'm just hoping, oh, I did get this in a large. So I got almost everything in a medium, but I got large for the jacket because I do a large, like in their cropped long sleeve tops, I do a large. So I just figured a large would fit better and holding it up, I definitely think that's gonna be better. And this is a large from the Mercury collection. 
Um, and then, okay, so back to my training items. We've got the loose fit shorts. I have these in black, and then I also have like a yellowish, kind of like highlighter yellow. I love them. They don't have any lining at all though. So just be aware, like I usually wear more of like a brief style undie underneath that's, you know, just like a black. Um, so just be aware. But what I love is this kind of like silicone strip around just makes them really stay put. So they don't have to, you know how like sometimes the elastic on these kind of shorts will like really suck in and then you get kind of like that muffin top. They don't have to do that because they have this. So that's going to help keep them in place from moving around without having to be really tight. But they just flow like they're just so flowy and nice. And then this sports bra is gorgeous. I have it in white. The white has a little bit more mesh up top, um, but I love the shape of it. It has um, cups that are actually sewn in, which is super nice because I hate when I'm doing laundry, like fixing all the cup pads and all the sports bras is like my pet peeve. I can't stand doing it. Comment down below if you hate fixing the cup pads in your sports bras when you do your laundry. Um, it does have a regular bra closure, which is really nice because that means like it's super easy to get on and off. Lately, it's been super hot and I've been struggling getting in and out of my sports bras. <laughs> um, but this would be super easy and it's very supportive. This is very supportive. It's also adjustable so you can bring up and down the straps, which is so nice. And it's just beautiful. Like it's just flattering something about that neckline. Like I don't know what it is, but it's really pretty. I also was just having these like burgundy vibes um, from watching Ashley Gata's videos when she's been like kind of talking about fall and stuff or the Fleck collection has the burgundy. So I decided to grab the Pippa in this quarter zip. I thought that would be so fun for fall. This is so soft. I actually have black Pippa joggers, but because I have a white dog, I don't wear them as much as I could. But the Pippa fabric is amazing. It is so soft. Wow. Um, this is also medium. I sometimes size down, but this is cropped. So I just wanted to make sure it was not too short. And then it has this cute little kangaroo pocket on the front and then the elastic at the bottom. And finally, I decided to try these green joggers because I was kind of on this green kick. Um, so these are just training joggers. I did get medium and now I'm thinking I probably should have got small and I have Pippa's in small, but I wasn't thinking. Um, these have pockets. They do have a drawstring. Um, then they have kind of the cuff at the bottom, but these just look really big, but we'll see. We'll see. We did it. We tried it all on. Here it all is. And I am kind of disappointed. <laughs> Um, the sports bras were so tight. I'm always a medium in Gymshark, except like I said, certain tops. And I guess these are part of that tops. <laughs> um, this was such a bummer. The blue was the tightest and then the green, I almost could get away with. Um, I did feel like I would like to see what a large feels like but it's maybe doable. So definitely the blue was really, really tight. The green was like a little less tight. And then the black out of the pants was the stretchiest. So I don't know what it is about the black material. I feel like you can even feel it when you go like that, but maybe I'm imagining it. Um, and then the shorts were just, not good like I know people were complaining about the length and I just thought because I'm so used to like my Fabletics shorts that I wear and I sometimes do wear longer shorts I was like oh I'll be fine but they weren't good it was just unfortunate um I did try just like rolling down the waist just because I saw a bunch of people doing that definitely going back I'm not even sure, like I want to keep this purpley blue color because it's so pretty, but I'm not even sure because I just feel like the green looked so much better. It's just so frustrating because I, 
I spent so much money and now to have to go like order another of this in a large and like, I don't even know if it's in stock right now. It's just frustrating and I did like enough so that I could get the free faster shipping and like I don't want to go spending all this more money. I actually really like this jacket. I thought this jacket was super awesome. I loved how it looked with the sports bra. Um, so I do, I do really want to see what a large feels like, but I also want to keep the medium just to compare, but I'm pretty sure I need a large in that. Um, these loose fit shorts, I don't know that they're like the most flattering on, but they're just like a good basic, you know what I mean? Um, the joggers, I think the size was right, but I did put on, right now I'm wearing the, um, Pippa joggers and the Pippa fabric is just so much nicer. So I do think I'll probably return the joggers just like, they're just all right. And I don't, I have so much stuff in my collection. I don't need to keep things that I'm not like obsessed with. Um, and then I'm currently wearing the training sports bra because this is what I ended the video in. Oh, P.S. I love this, this Pippa. I don't know how I never had this before, but I absolutely love this so much. Definitely a keeper and like how cute would that be with the black butterfly leggings? Like I did not expect to like obsess over these black butterfly leggings, but this was so cute. Um, and then the, so the training bra I have on was tighter. I swear it's tighter than my white one and I bought a medium. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. So there were definitely some really good pieces. But it's just frustrating when like you have shopped a brand a bunch and you're used to your size and then they come out with something that's like slightly different and then the size just feels totally off. Like how many Gymshark sports bras do I have in size medium in my collection? And then I buy a size medium and it's teeny tiny. Like it just, I had like this fat thing hanging out. Like nobody wants that. And like, honestly, if I can just like take a moment to be honest, it makes me feel crappy. Like. I know that I have gained weight since this time last year and I've talked about that openly on my channel. Um, what I was doing to stay the size I was was not sustainable. It worked when it worked and then it stopped working for me and it took me way too long to realize that. So I'm just trying to like embrace this new body of mine and like even this morning I looked in the mirror and I was like, you know, a few years ago, what you have now is what you were dreaming of. And so I just am trying to like embrace who I am and how I am and like know that I'm so blessed to have a body that I can, you know, go to the gym and just I'm fully functioning and I can train for a marathon. And I, I know that that's like amazing. And I just want to keep thanking my body so much for that but when a company that you love comes out with clothes that aren't fitting how you think they're supposed to i know that it's the clothes and it's not me but it's hard like psychologically it's hard not to see that chub coming out from your armpit and like think that it's you think that it's your body um you know, so that was like a weird tangent, but I kind of like the whole point of this whole active wear experience is because when you have an awesome outfit, you feel amazing. Like that is what changed going to the gym for me. As soon as I discovered like cute workout clothes, that was everything. So when I put workout clothes on and I don't feel good about myself because they cut in in weird places, like I need to learn to accept that I'm not at fault, but it's a long road. So if you've ever put on a pair of leggings and you know, didn't like the muffin top it gave you or a sports bra and you get like the sports bra muffin top, I'm there with you and we're in this together. That's why I am here to recommend the best active wear and tell you why, you know, what you can wear it for and how it fits. 
so that hopefully you don't have this experience of trying on a sports bra that's your normal size, but it doesn't fit because it's cut smaller than normal. So I hope this helped you if you're planning on getting the butterfly line to know it's not you, it's the sports bra, just size up and then avoid the drama. <laughs> so if you're still watching, comment down the word sangria because <laughs> There's a sangria candle across the room for me. Comment the word sangria. And I appreciate you so much. And I love this community. And I'm just so glad that we're here together. So I hope I can keep inspiring you because you're inspiring me. And I will see you in the next video soon. Have a great day. Stay positive. Bye.